हेलो बच्चों तो देखो भैया ये एक और सवाल है गेट 2021 का क्वेश्चन नंबर 14 है ये ठीक है इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड कम्युनिकेशन इसको खराब नहीं करता मैं पीडीएफ को ठीक है तो क्वेश्चन नंबर 14 है ये सेक्शन इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड क्रेली कम्युनिकेशन ठीक है आ, क्योंकि इंग्लिश वगैरह में तो हमें कोई डाउट है नहीं चलिए तो ये नाइक्विज का क्वेश्चन था आपको पता होगा आपने किया होगा तो देखा हुआ लग रहा होगा आपको ये तो इसमें हम लोगों ने मतलब मैं इसको ऑब्वियसली चैलेंज कर रहा हूं क्योंकि जो ग्राउंड है वो यही है कि इन दिस क्वेश्चन वी फॉलो द कन्वेंशन एज टॉट देखो क्या लिखा है इट वी फॉलो द कन्वेंशन एज टॉट बाय आवर बीलविड फैकल्टीज ऑफ आईआईटी एट एनपीटीईएल प्लेटफॉर्म ओके so i am attaching the screenshot of the pdf from where i have studied the nyquist criteria so in this nyquist criteria this is a nptel pdf okay of iit madras uh, the 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 contour so we can see that we can see that contour is clockwise okay the contour is clockwise so here it is it is clearly mentioned that the contour is by default clockwise in the right half of the s plane by default clockwise in the right half of the s plane thus solving with this concept we can see that the nyquist plot given in the question there are two clockwise encirclement of the origin wo aap dekh sakte ho figure mein Open loop system has one zero in the right half of the S plane. So by using the concept n equals to z minus p, where n is a number of clockwise encirclement of origin, z is number of open loop in the right open loop pole. Open loop zero होना चाहिए. देखो गड़बड़ कर दिया हमने. Open loop zero in the right half. In the right half of the S plane, p is the number of open loop pole in the right half of the S plane. So by solving this, we can get that two equals to one minus p. That is p is equals to minus one. Since the number of pole cannot be negative, so this question has some misinformation. Okay, but if we solve it by case two, मतलब जैसा कि बहुत सारे लोग बता भी रहे हैं कि हमें contour उल्टा ले लेना चाहिए, तो हम वही करते हैं. Case two, respected sir or madam, if we consider the contour anti-clockwise, which is neither mentioned. okay which is neither mentioned in the question nor taught by any faculty on the nptel platform the source from where we all study okay we all study from nptel okay so the source from where we all study then the nyquist criteria so if we do solve like this Z is a number of, so this is the contour now, a clockwise encirclement. N is a number of anti-clock, clock over, anti-clock, anti-clock. हाँ, ठीक है, ठीक है. N N is a number of anti-clock encirclement of the origin. Z is a number of open loop pole in the right half. Number of open loop pole in the right half. ठीक है, open loop zero, open loop pole. तो यहाँ से solve करेंगे तो number of open loop pole आ जाएंगे, तीन आ जाएंगे, ठीक है? अब उसके बाद Now the Nyquist stability criteria says that n equals to z minus p, where n is a number of anti-clock, ठीक है, anti-clock encirclement of the minus one comma zero. Z is a number of zeros in the open loop in the right half. P is a number of open loop pole in the right half. So we can see that by solving this, we get z equals to three. So we have three poles of the closed loop in the right half of the S plane. So here the answer three is coming from here. Sir, we got the answer three. But respected sir or madam, since the direction of contour was not mentioned in was not mentioned, and we always solve by using the default contour. अच्छा complete नहीं किया मैं यहीं complete कर देता हूँ. By using the default contour, that is that is clockwise in the right half of the S plane.
so i would request you to to count this question or i would say that i would request you to to give marks to all mta in this question as as there is some there is misinformation or lack of information in the question so but still i would suggest matlab main yahi manta hu ki gate wala ho sakta hai na consider kare okay but still we'll try it there is misinformation or lack of information in the question okay so this is what i will be submitting on this question okay and after this i will be i will be challenging uh, two more questions or uh, adc dsc question i will be challenging and mathematics question i will be challenging okay so thank you students enjoy bye bye